Yo yo people, Garrett Jun here for another video. So guys, this video is gonna be in Farming Star 19, and today we are gonna be playing as a firefighter. So let's go ahead and get started. Radio and Garrett. Garrett, this is Sergeant Spencer. Are you responding to the call with me? It looks like we have a 35-year-old Caucasian male in a black 1500 Chevy pickup truck just down at this gas station here, this come and go. And he got ran off the road, it sounds like, by an aggressive driver, and he's in the water. So he is, he's fine. No more water coming in, but he, he's trapped in there. Okay, so you said it's down, uh, like, a steep hill or some kind of yep. incline? It's going to be pretty tough to get down there. And you know, it's just this, it's this, how do I, it's like this inlet to the river, pretty much, where over, overflow water comes. And I'll show you once we get down here. All right, perfect. But yeah, it's going to be pretty steep right here on our left in the shade. It's hard to see his pickup. I just barely saw it. All right. All right, I'm on scene, big cat. I'm thinking here, let me jump out. Probably pull. Watch out for these bushes. Just pull to the left of me here. Okay. Sounds just don't good. go too far. It could be steep. It's yeah. all right if you block, block the road. That's fine, too. Okay. Thinking right around here. Should be good. All right, Garrett. I'm going to go talk down, go down there and talk with him. But if you want to get the winch, I think... It looks like his, his truck is shut off. The engine is flooded. I think we got to pull it up first. Okay. Pull yeah. it up out of the water. That'd probably be the safest way to make sure that it's not going to slide or anything when we're trying to get him out of there. Yeah, for sure. And then the ambulance just showed up too. We got a stretcher ready and they'll they'll get to him. But it's just too dangerous for them <laughs> to come down here and get him out right now. Definitely. All right. I got the line. Let's All right. Watch I'm your going steps, in the Spence. water. All right. Stay safe. All right, sir. We're going to get you out of here, sir. We're going to pull you out first, so just make sure your vehicle is in neutral. Just keep it in neutral. Is he is he hearing you? Is he all conscious? Yep. He's, yep. He, he's good. He's good. He's just startled. I think his hand's bleeding a little bit, too. I don't know what that's from. Okay. I'm going to tighten the cable. Here, let's uh, take a step back. Yep, for sure. There we go. Don't Just in case it snaps or anything. It's, so it's, uh, it's Chevy 1500. You should be able to pull it, but yeah. Here, I'm gonna, this is pretty steep. I'm going to come to the controls here. There we go. Perfect. All right, we'll keep pulling her back. There we go. She's moving. Nice, nice. There we go. Yeah, that looks good. It looks like the front end was kind of stuck in the mud a bit, but... Mm -hmm. Yeah, we got just it. Just keep going. Let's see. I might get my pickup. I'm going to get my pickup out of the way for you. All right, perfect. Keep moving um, it back till it's completely safe. Uh, do you think there's good? That's good. Yep, perfect. All right. I'll stay attached just in case it slides or oh, anything. Good point. I was like, oh, we could detach. <laughs> yeah, All no, right, not, sir, not the safest. Ahead. Go ahead, sir. Step out if you can for me. There, there we, we go. go. Perfect. All right, I'm going to get the stretcher if you want to do just check up on him. Yeah, yeah. Here, can you hold out your left arm, please? Thank you. Awesome. It looks good. Right arm. Nicely done. Okay, do you have any pain? No. Okay, Spence, he looks to be pretty good. All right, I'm bringing the stretcher out right now, though. Don't want right. to risk anything. Yeah, yeah, definitely want to get him there just to be safe. All right, sir, go ahead. Just step up here on the stretcher nice and easy. There we go. go. Just lay there, and then we'll push you, sir. Here, let's lower it down a bit. There we go. Awesome. There we go. Is it in? Move it a bit further. Perfect. All right. All right, we here. I'll, if you want to get straps on him. Yeah. There, there we go. go. And close up the doors. Perfect. All right. I'm going to take him in to, if you want to get some of this stuff cleared up, get traffic moving, I'm going to go take him to the hospital, and I'll be back here. Okay. Sounds good. All right. I'll see you in a bit. All right. Have a safe drive. we Will do. All right, guys. So we got this vehicle out of the mud. It was very heavy, not going to lie, uh, but we did do it, so it's good to see. Now we are very close to our fire or ladder truck there. Let me see if I can maybe move this over a little. Here we go. Yeah, look at our wheels. They're just spinning. It is so heavy. Okay, I'm gonna see if we can pull it in just a little. Come on. There we go. Nicely done. Just so it's not gonna slide. And then I think we should be good to detach now. Not really worried about that. So here we go. All right, got that done. So we can now go ahead, fold up our back here we are just like so should be should be all fine and dandy and yeah let's uh finish up this scene 
All right, Garrett, he's in there. Nurses and doctors, first impressions, thought he was going to do pretty good. So, yeah. which I did too. Um, so, yeah. There was, Let's go there was no complications, this. like when transporting? No, that was pretty easy. The, those those straps really held in the stretcher nice. Oh, yeah? Okay, perfect. Glad to hear. So let's just clean up this place. And tow truck is on his way. I put in the call for it on my way back from the hospital. So that should be here any minute. And, okay. And, yeah. Sounds like a plan. I'll just, we'll start taking some stuff back here. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we have a lot, lot to move around. <laughs> Dude, I haven't seen this Land Cruiser up close and personal, but what? How this thing is huge. I know it is so high off the ground. I don't even know what tires these are, but gets the job done. <laughs> Look at it compared to the ambulance. The top of the roof of the, of the ambulance is equal to this. Holy cow! And ambulances are known for being quite tall. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. You could stand up in them. Oh yeah, that is crazy. I didn't, actually never really compared the two. That's awesome. All right, I'm gonna head back, man. I will. I'll be back to get my pickup truck too. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and take the Land Cruiser, move that away. There we go. We'll drive this back to the station as well. Also, guys, we do have our ladders on the top here, which is very, very nice. Uh, by the way, for anyone wondering, the ambulance was made by Lambo Mods. This truck right here, uh, the initial body was made by Expendables Modding. But if you want the fire department wildland fire rescue version, uh, that is also by Lambo Mods. The ladder truck was Lambo Mods. The police vehicle, I'm not quite sure. That's one that Spencer already had. But yeah, lots of cool mods out there. If you guys want to check out Lambo Mods, you can down below. I'll have them linked. He is actually also a sponsor for this video. So shout out to him for making these mods and for making this video possible. But let's go ahead and finish cleaning up. Join Lambo Mods Patreon page to instantly receive access to some amazing modding creations. You will get early access to Lambo, Winston, and Beardshot's awesome ideas. On top of all that, you will get cool textures and other unique modding tools. Join today using the link below. Alright, we're pulling into the station now. There we go. We actually were coming in pretty hot. <laughs> but it's all good. I'm going to park this, I'm thinking, right behind the ambulance. So then the lad truck can just be driven straight through. All right, guys, so they are removing the vehicle, it seems. Spencer has the road blocked, and then I guess we have our tow truck driver just connecting everything up. Very, very cool. I'm going to go ahead, though, and get moving here so we can start up the giant engine. There we go. Or I guess the giant ladder. Haha. <laughs> um, yeah, okay. Turn this thing around. Nicely done. Can probably turn off the lights now, and I'll just drive on back to the station. All right, guys, I got the ladder truck to the fire station now. Here we go. I'm thinking let's actually drive around the place so we can just drive it straight through, as I mentioned. Oh, yeah, we'll get this in here. There we go. Perfect. Let's had to slow down at the bump. Let's go right to the wall. There we go. I think that's enough space between the ambulance. Yeah, that's a, that's a pretty solid position. There we are. Oh, look at that. Absolutely fantastic. Got enough clearance at the front. Yep. And we should be good. Seems like Spencer's headed back. And then let's close up this one as well. Perfect. All right, I'll see you guys in a sec. All right, Gary, I just got a call. There's been a tractor accident just half a mile away from here. Okay, okay. I'm opening up the doors. Uh, should take I bring your, your ambulance? Take your ambulance. Take yeah. your ambulance. All right. Sounds like the driver of the tractor... Uh, has fear concussion he was knocked out for over five seconds oh okay that is not good let's so head on over head, yep we're gonna head down this gravel this gravel road we'll take our next right it's on uh yeah our next right here and then so it sounds like guy in a red pickup truck was going way too fast and the farmer pulled out the guy's trying to remember things right now and this is super soon there is a red truck that was just flying there but let's respond to the guy here okay yeah, I'm just down the road. Got to go a little bit slower due to the yep. size of this thing. <laughs> there you go. We're going to have our EMS right here. He's pulling in. Just walk with me to the ambulance. Here, you can hold my hand. All right, his name's going to be Garrett. He's going to take care of you. How are you, how are you feeling right now? Oh, well, uh, I don't remember much. You don't remember much. I heard on the radio you lost consciousness for a few seconds there. Yeah, I remember a red truck hitting me, almost hitting me, and then it I swore was red. 
Yeah, it, it was red. Was it... Do you know anything else about the truck? No, I don't really know. It was a big truck. It was a big okay. truck. All right, that narrows it like, down. <laughs> which way was he driving? He was going that way. Okay. All I right. think I saw him. Yeah? Okay, Garrett, you deal with the patient here. I'm going to go take off after him. Okay. All right, stay safe. Good yep, luck. You too. All right, so you said that you lost consciousness. Are, are your hands and legs feeling okay, or are you... Yeah, I feel fine. Yeah? I just lost consciousness. Do you think of any broken bones or anything hurting more than other parts of your body? Don't think so. You don't think so? All right. Uh, I'm going to have you still get on the stretcher. Let me just go ahead and remove the straps and lower it out for you. All right. Do you want to go ahead and lay on there? Perfect. Nicely done. I'm just going to bring you inside, okay? Okay. Here we go. Just sit still. Perfect. All right. So you're saying your head hurts a little bit, but besides for that, you're doing okay? Yep. All right. Um, I'm going to just then bring you to the hospital. Can you just look in this light for me really quick? Just follow it with your eyes. Do not move your head. Just want to make sure you're all good. Yep. All right. Perfect. All right. So I'm going to go ahead and strap you down. Uh, if anything happens or you aren't feeling good or something changes, let me know right away. Sounds good. All right. Perfect. All right. We got him here. Let's go ahead and get moving. I'm going to head on over to the hospital it is honestly quite far away from here this is not the most ideal location but yeah it, it would also be nice to still have some kind of cops on the scene doesn't seem like we'll be able to do that though because they are busy chasing after there we go i think i might even see them in the distance so let's go ahead get out of the way i do not want to get caught up in the chase or whatever is happening there i'll see you guys when we are a little bit closer here we go. There is the hospital, just like so. I'm going to pull up right over here. All right. How are, how are you doing, sir? Good. You're doing good? How was the ride? All good. Yeah, no issues. I was a good driver. Nope. <laughs> yeah. All right, let me just get these straps off you real quick. Okay, perfect. Here we go. I'm going to go ahead and start bringing you out. Just uh, sit as still as you can. There we go. Perfect. Raising you up. And I'll bring you just inside so the doctors can take a look at you. Alrighty, so there we go, guys. Let's go ahead, grab the stretcher. Got them all processed, so we're all good. There we go. Let's put on the straps, close up the doors. I'm going to go ahead and turn off our lights now so we can head on back to the station. Because that's going to wrap it up here. I really do appreciate you guys watching this video. Also, shout out to Bolt YT. He has a YouTube channel. And to Spencer TV. Obviously, he also has a YouTube channel. Um, thank you so much for them helping out to make this video possible. And yeah, I think that's about it there. Also, just going to quickly mention, please check the description. Lots of awesome things down there. Uh, you guys can join our Discord server, join our Patreon page, become a channel member to get access to exclusive videos this month. Very, very cool. And yeah, I'm actually starting a new series that's only for channel members in a different game too. But if you want to find out more about that, you're going to go ahead and have to join. Uh, but yeah, besides for that, check out all our social media pages. Follow me, Twitter, Instagram. You know, you know the drill. You guys are awesome. Bye-bye. Want to play games with your friends? Grab a dedicated server from G Portal. Make sure to click the link down below to receive an instant 5% discount.